hello wordpress nerds so in this video we are going to talk about programmatically upload file to media library so first of all what is media library so let me show you that first so this is my local wordpress site and in your wordpress site in the back end if you see this section called media library so this is media library where you can add your image or any kind of attachments in this so this is media library and we are going to learn how to upload file via code so before jumping into the code let me show you what we are going to do so in our previous video we see that how to upload file uh, using WordPress functions so this is similar to um, so this video is similar to that video but in previous video difference was that the attachment was not going into the media library it was just um, going into a folder so I would suggest you watch that video first and then come back again on this video otherwise if you know what you are doing just keep watching the video so let's go to the plugin section and yeah here is the custom plugin in which we add all my code for the demonstration and today again I am going to use this plugin only so let's jump into the code so let me open my custom plugin so this is my wordpress repo content plugin and my plugin and inside I have created image uploader dot php so we are going to use that only so what i have done in this file that i have created a short code uh, which simply displays this form and in this form we are just adding a file type field one hidden field just to confirm that the form is submitted and one submit button so let me show you the page we created in previous video using short code so this is the page let's view the page and this is the short code which displays the file uploader and the submit button and now so previously i showed you uploading image without being add, added into a media library now in this video we are going to add that into the media library so let's catch the form submission to init let's confirm the submission so we will check this field method is post encryption type also added if you don't add this part you won't be able to get file in your post data
so now let's confirm if we get our files in our post data or not so now let's try to upload any image let's say this reminder.png submit and yes we are getting the data into uh, file global that means the submission is working fine now let's upload this uploaded file into media library over here so let me refresh this page and here are some already uploaded files now what function do we need to use in order to upload file into media library so for that we can use this media handle upload so let's use this function assign to some variable it will return attachment id now what are the arguments we need to pass so first argument is file which is the index of dollar file in which you your your file is there so before adding that let's confirm in which parameter or file is coming so it is coming inside my file so we have to add this parameter over here sorry the so first argument will be the key of file then the second argument will be post id so in which post id uh, you want to assign this image and if you don't want to assign image to any post id just past pass zero so for this i am going to pass zero so i'm just going to show you that it will upload only into the media library and not assign into some post and now let's try to war dump this now let's try to upload an image sample.jpg submit okay so now we are getting this fatal error this is very important so whenever you get whenever you use this function and if you get the fatal error we have to include some files so which file we need to include so we need to include these three files so let's include that those three files and now submit again let's submit that image again sample.jpg so we are getting some number this is the attachment id so here now let's see our file should be added in the, into this library so as you can see this is the sample and here is the attachment id which we get over here let's confirm two double six double two two double six double two let's try to 
upload another one test.jpg two double six two three refresh two double six two three and the file will be stored at current years current month folder so this is taken by WordPress by default we haven't passed any path or something this is uh, directly taken by WordPress itself so yeah this is how simply you can use the upload upload ima image or attachment function for your custom plugin or theme so this is the video guys if you have any doubt or question please write down below in the comment section thanks for watching the video